Hello everyone, and welcome to a game I never thought that I'd be playing. <laughs> American Truck Simulator. And I never thought that I would record it, either. But, I've been a little under the weather lately. And so I just wanted something chill to, to come back to. All right, let's get a uh, get rolling, I guess. Ooh. All right. All set. All right. All right. Let's get rolling. Talk about here we. I do not have any try. I didn't expect to go heavy southern accent as soon as I started recording, but that's where I'm at. That's fine. That's fine. Ooh. Damn it! I'm immediately fucking hitting shit. Okay. All right. That's fine. Oh god. I'm doing it. Alright, alright. I'm clear, I'm clear, I'm clear. Alright, good, good, good. Alright, here we go, here we go. Sorry, sorry, sorry back there. I really have no idea what it is about this game that has been calling to me for so long, but I wanted to play it. I did. Now I am. And all I have to say is, fuck, why am I playing this? Uh, you know, I, I, I used to play this game for... Maybe it wasn't this game. I think it was like Ice Road Truckers or something like that when I was a kid. I had this one friend. He had this game that we used to play. Uh, his dad played it a lot, and whenever we got on the computer, we were able to play it. I don't think we did a good job. It might have been American Trucking Simulator. It might not have been. I don't know. Uh, I found the blinker button. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Fine. Oh god, no, don't, 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 don't do anything, don't do anything, don't do anything. Don't hit, don't hit, don't hit, don't hit. Oh, I'm good, I cleared it! Absolutely fuck some people over, but that's fine. So far, no damage that I know of. Do I have any damage? No damage, no damage. So, what the fuck happened over there? That looks pretty bad. Whoopsies, how does that happen? I can't imagine this will be too exciting. But I'm gonna play it anyways. It's been calling my name for so long. And then it went on sale and it's like dirt cheap, so I was just like, how could I say no? Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Sorry, 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 sorry. No, 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 don't hit anything, don't hit anything. Good. I am good. Oh no, that's making it worse. All right, let the people go by. Let the people go by. Fuck you, sir. All right, I can fix this. I can fix this. Maybe. Um. I can fix this. I can fix this. I can fix this. I'll just, I'll, 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 I'll make a swing back around. Oh, that was a police officer. No, I'm gonna grind. God, being a fucking truck driver is hard. It's fine if you, if you you can you can always take a second stab at something. If you if you're having some difficulties, take a second stab. It goes for people too. <laughs> oh fuck! Am I okay? I'm okay. How do you fuck up this bad though? Like, has anybody ever seen this happen? For like a sewer? grate is spewing out water like that? That seems insane. That's just a sewer grate. I thought that was a fire hydrant. Second stab's the, the, the charm. Second charm's the stab. Oh, come on! Oh, God, it's slow! Fucking hate drains. This better? This better? This seems better? This seems better? No, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Okay! Second stab's the charm. Right up to Air, Air, right up through Arizona. How much Southern can I get? <gasps> First real job. Where the fuck am I? I guess I showed up here to pick up this giant spool of wire, huh? All right. It's actually quite the easy start since no one's coming. Easy to pull out. Didn't use my turn signals, that's fine. 
Am I going to... You want me to turn around? Hold on. You want me to fucking turn around? Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh. I can figure this out. Uh-oh. Can I? Oh, I might be able to make this turn. Oh, I actually made the turn. I'm impressed. I did it. Whoa! 255 miles or 200 some odd miles to empty. Oh, do I got an email? What the fuck do I do with emails? How southern did y'all expect the plague doctor to be, huh? A plague doctor, asexual, demisexual witch. Everybody's surprised. Am I gonna buy all the fucking d DLCs for this game? God damn it. I saw they got a Texas DLC coming out soon. And as a man from Texas, I am excited for it. I'm unnaturally excited for it. I've been thinking about looking into that, like, uh, other, you know, there's VR chat. I found another one recently called Neos VR. Seems interesting, I might try it. But I have so much social anxiety, I don't know how it will go. Also, uh, there is some sort of like big, like not conspiracy. That loud noise from me sticking my head out the window scared the shit out of me. I will be getting back to like uh, my other series, like uh, the Zombie Army and uh, Diagonalisma. Uh, soon. I just I've been so sick. Uh, I couldn't get a video up. Uh, what was it? Wednesday. Wednesday, Thursday. Well, I couldn't get a video up Thursday because because uh, I was too sick. And I, but and now and now I'm still sick. Oh, I've discovered Phoenix. Now I'm still sick, but I'm doing better and I'm able to record. But I, I just don't have the energy for any like intense game like Diasmo where I can't where I can't be bad or I'll die or like a uh, zombie army where I got to focus on so much. I just thought this, this might be a good little game to come back to. I will, again, I'll, I'll go back to those games. I'll, I'm probably gonna finish them at some point. Uh, but I just gotta not crash super hard. I forgot to take the garbage cans out today. Whoopsies. I don't know why I slip into such a heavy Southern accent whenever I'm nervous. Part of me wants to get like a full-on steering setup, you know, a shifter, steering wheel, all that. I don't know why. Like, so, like, I think it's just part of the ADHD of wanting to like heavily get into a new uh, hobby. Which sucks. Cause I've spent a lot of money on new hobbies, but that's fine. Everything's fine. I'll hear that. Uh, that whole Yellowstone is going to be the next uh, destroyer of humanity is just fucking uh, not true. Like uh, all those TikTokers that are like, if if when Ye Yellowstone could potentially be the next de destroyer of uh, life as we know it, if it erupts and it's like over uh, like two hundred years to erupt, it's past due. It'll, it, it'll destroy humanity. It's just, like, it's not true. Not true whatsoever. All of that's lie. That is, like, if they just looked between the time of the last two eruptions and just took that, but it's erupted a couple times and the medium times between them is not that. And, like, there's another couple hundred years before it's expected to erupt. However, it's not even expected to erupt anymore because of the magma and the... Listen, I'm giving y'all a lot of boring. I'm running out of gas. I'll try to park super fast. I'm giving y'all a lot of boring science stuff, but like actual scientists are watching like to make sure that that... that like... That we have scientists that like keep track of this shit. Don't believe what you see on TikTok. I can get this parked before I run out of gas. All right! First job, highly successful. My secondary monitor is starting to flash like crazy. Like it keeps flashing green and then it'll turn back on. And I don't know what that means at this point. I don't want to buy a new one. So I won't. 
every now and then I think about, uh, I've, I've had several stupid plans so far for, for like, even just recording this game. I was like, you know what, I've, I've seen Jay Slat, just Slat, I don't know how to say his name, but play this game drunk. I could probably do a, a drink and play, a drunk let's play of American Truck Simulator. Ooh, I'm surprised I took that turn so well. Research, I got the ability to save. There was no stop sign for me, I'm not stopping. I got the ability to save like gas. Things go great. I've been on some road trips, man. I have been on some road trip. Like I've never fl flown in a plane, but I have been on some. So like anytime I need to get anywhere, it's just some fucking road trips. Oh, I mean like been on a fucking hell drive from Texas to Florida with my grandpa in a convertible that um, the condensation line for the AC was clogged. And so all, all the condensation line was dripping onto my toes throughout the entire trip. And I would try and take naps. We, we like the, the entire trip I would try and take naps because I, I like I, I didn't fully want to be there but I was there and I was just like you know this this is not the part of the trip the part of the trip is gonna be at a fucking Air Force base in Florida in the summertime fuck it was fucking hot as hell when I was there but uh that trip like he kept playing audiobooks and I can't take a nap while someone's talking like it messes with me so like i like th throughout most of the trip i would semi fall asleep the condensation i'm tri be dripping on my toes uh, like i think like my toes were like it, it, the, like my socks were wet for this like i don't even know how long the drive was maybe nine ten hours or just this long fucking drive of hell and then like my feet were fucked up because the socks were wet and like it was like it was like i don't know if y'all have ever what does it say road work ahead i sure hope it does such a stupid joke anyways <laughs> like if you if you have uh, i'm not gonna run you over car if you wear like fucking wet socks for hours your, your fucking feet are fucked up and that's how I showed up to Florida with my grandpa, who's an asshole. Stopped in, uh, what was it, Alabama? Uh, we stopped at, like, uh, like a battleship? But yeah, on that trip, we stopped at a battleship. That was pretty cool. My grandpa sprayed me with deer brains once. That was a terrible day. I will not elaborate any further on this. What other road trips have I been on? I've made several trips all the way up to Iowa from Texas. And that was that, like just solo driving. Cause you know, I don't, I don't do planes. I, I do, I do driving. Why? I don't know. Planes are scary. I can load up all my shit in a truck and leave whenever I want. Colorado, Dri driven up to Colorado a couple times. I have some family members up there. It, it, like. This is this probably come out over the, over the years of just I don't have the best family. <laughs> like I have an older stepbrother that is dating a 19 year old in his 30s. That my cousin, who is just out of high school, introduced them to. And just that's a bit of a weird situation. I say if they're both down for it, they went to a a, a concert or something. Did a lot of drugs. My stepbrother had to go to the hospital. The girlfriend. Just did more drugs. I should probably stop talking about my family. <laughs> There's small things that I can talk about. <laughs> I just remembered I went fishing one time with my uh, with my brother, uncle, and dad at my grandpa's house, and my uncle, I caught a fish. My uncle grabbed the fish, went over, and slapped my brother with it. That was a fun time. He was pretty mad. He was mad at me because I caught the fish and gave it to him, which I, I feel like wasn't my fault. About ah, ah. it's fine. I've been playing this game with a buddy called uh, Ready or Not, and one of the levels is just this crack house, right? And you know, at first, like first couple times there, I was just like, "Damn, this place sucks." And then I started thinking about it. I lived in a place that was just about as bad as this, with somewhat less drugs. 
I had a snake fall on my bed. Rats in my walls. I never had the ceiling finished. Owls moved in above my room. I thought there were rats screaming in the walls, but it turns out it was baby owls that got stuck over, like, in the insulation that was behind, like, the covered ceiling. I had an uncovered part of the ceiling where it was just bare insulation, but that was off to the other side of the room. Uh, but they, they wormed their way in to that side and were just, I, I don't know if they were stuck there, but every night they'd be screaming for the mother owl to bring them food. And every night it would wake me up for, like, months. Then the owl nest fell into my bedroom. Like, there was an upper, like, the AC was routed by, like, a dumbass. And it came in through like a little little tube, like 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 you see in those horror games, where like it's just random ductwork that is just jutting out from the ceiling that you can climb into and whatnot. It was almost like that, and like, but like on the other, on like it was right up against my wall, and my wall led to like a little square outside, and like. They found a little perch where it wasn't fully complete, and that's where they set up their nest, and that nest somehow got pushed through the wall. I don't know if they, like, ate away at a little bit or just whatever fucking bullshit was going on there didn't hold, and it just kind of pushed in, and an owl nest has so much shit in it. So, like, all of the shit is in there. Like, all the bird shit. And so, and like there was eggs and it fell in. The smell was fucking terrible. And I, I had to get a ladder, go up there and clean it all out. And it was, oh man, where am I? <laughs> I've been telling stories. I've been just on a random train of thought. And you know, I'm keeping it on the road at least. At that house, we had a Lord of the Fly situation where, uh oh, all right. I didn't see the merch sign. At that house, we had a Lord of the Flies situation where something died at some point. No one found it. And then the flies found it and had... I won't go into too much detail. But eventually, uh, we went into the kitchen one day and there was just a thousand flies. And like... Me and my dad were working or something, I don't fully remember. Or like, I had something to do and it was out. And then my dad was telling me that like, yeah, something's going on in the kitchen or something. Ma your mom says it's like Lord of the Flies. I think she's just exaggerating. Just gra grab the fly swatter and go down there and you know, take care of it. And I'm like, all right. And I go in there and she was not exaggerating. There were like fucking a hundred or so like fucking big ass horse flies just flying around the kitchen in this giant horde and just like oh god that was a house man that was a fucking house it was not a complete house at all i built some of it i had to build my own room but like i was i i couldn't i like i didn't have a job i couldn't buy more materials i'm complaining a lot <laughs> No, sometimes you just gotta let it out. Alright, fuck you for cutting me off, asshole! I had my blinker on! You saw I was getting over! It's fine. Oh, I think I'm getting close. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kinda wanted to watch that Kingsman movie, but I, I'm so bad about watching movies. Like, you know the Kingsman Golden Circle or whatever it was, where it's just like the fancy lads doing action hero stuff. <laughs> Seems like a cool movie. I never watched it though. All right, everyone. I think I'm gonna stop there. I do have some things I'm gonna have to take care of today. So, I'm gonna call it there. I hope y'all enjoyed my inane ramblings. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll get back to the normal stuff, the other action games here soon. I'm just, I'm just trying to get back in the saddle after being sick with something. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!